we can actually be the change Yes, for ourselves, but also for the people around us. This is so true. And if you look at the work of Nicholas Christakis, I'm not sure if you're familiar with him. He's the network researcher, genius researcher. And he's done all this study about how our emotions and habits flow through networks on a, on a mass scale, like 200,000 people. And his research will blow your mind. It blows my mind. Wow. He said this, if someone in your immediate social circle becomes obese, for example, the chances of you becoming obese jumps by about 45%. If someone, if one of your friend's friends becomes obese, the chances of you becoming obese still jumps by 25%. But this is when it blows your mind. If a friend's friend's friend, so free out, becomes obese, your chances of becoming obese goes up by 10%. And he's mirrored this for all the big habitual changes and emotions that flow in and out of networks. So what does that say to me? Right, be at the epicenter. Be the change that you want to see in the world. So if you've got people that you love that are drinking too much or they're not moving their bodies or they're overweight and unhealthy, rather than lecture them, like you said, be the change, as Gandhi once said, that you want to see yeah. in the world. Make the change yourself. Have the courage and let it spread outwards. Yeah. Yeah. 